Okay, in this video, we will be sharing with you uh, what I like to call the people aspect, uh, which is typically consists of many things, right? Let's go through them and uh, explore them. From the home page, uh, let me go back to home, right? You remember we have the community of practice and administrative button if you've watched the previous video. So if we go here, there is a knowledge portal. So let's go through the knowledge portal one by one. And there are some guidelines. This is being redesigned. We are going to combine the knowledge portal and rule guide, but at least the, the functionalities and the component would remain the same. So in the knowledge portal, we have a community library. And if I click on this right now, you will see it's empty. Uh, and the reason for that, because we are just going to market right now with the platform and the community library is for you, the users to share information with the community. So anything that you are or your organization is willing to share openly, non-confidential information, uh, tips and tricks, learning, anything you would like to share publicly, you put it here. If you want to share it only privately within your company, then there is you will use what we call the client library. This is why we want to combine all of these in one place so you can easily see all of this. So the client library is, are the information that will be restricted to your company, whereas the community library is open to all. So you have to be very careful. And obviously, if you try to go to add something here, let me show you. Uh, I'll say, okay, let's say if I want to add something new. Uh, and uh, that basically you will be able to add uh, whatever the title is, and then you can upload the file, etc., etc. So you will be able to add information here. Again, it's open to all. And then, of course, you have what we call project management cl clarification. This is more or less like the definition that we use in the platform for various things that might be different than what your conventional wisdom is. For example, what is a project? What is a program? What is a portfolio? Um, what in the end of the project, the captured lesson, difference between captured lesson and lesson learned. And obviously with time, we will be adding a lot of document here. Then there are case studies. And in, at this time, these case studies are uh, basically, they are eBooks that we have published, but they include a case study inside of them. We could include other case studies. They don't have to be published eBooks in the future. Uh, I think it's, it's important to mention here that the community library, again, is for all. However, all of these other areas, is you, they are for you to view. You cannot add anything here. This is where we add information uh, and we add it uh, for your benefit. Ebooks, uh, so far I have published 17 ebooks. All of them are here and they are accessible for you. And of course, if there's any educational medias, uh, it's empty right now. We will be adding educational videos here down the road. And so if I go back to the home page, we talk about knowledge portal and the Uruk guide. Now let, let's talk about the Uruk guide. Now the main difference between the two, the Uruk guide are the, well, let me give you maybe of a hierarchy. Sorry. So step back for a second. Uh, if I go to the home page, the home page include here on the home screen, the welcome package. So these are the things that are necessary to help you get started on the roof platform, get started on the right foot, uh, basically, uh, instead of a judge, because this is, again, this is a very uh, comprehensive solution. It's not just basic tool to add task or add uh, information. It's, it's uh, the, you can do a lot in the platform. So the first step is obviously in helping you to use the platform. We have the welcome package, which should be there to guide you get started. Then we have the Uruk guide, and these are the information and other information that will be available to help you with time master the Uruk platform. Uh, so there are general information, there will be demos, for example, like this video demo. Uh, these are all demos, we will be replacing them with these videos demo that we are recording right now. Uh, these educational demos, so they will be here. Uh, you can access them from here. They will be able, we haven't recorded any tutorial yet, we will soon. Uh, the welcome package, you've seen it already, it's here. And there are other guideline documents you can see from here. And we will continue to add document uh, as we continue to develop the platform. So the Uruk guideline and the Uruk guide section 
are it's there for the information to help you again master the Rook platform to know the if you want to go go into in depth learning of the platform that where you do it uh, and then we talked about the knowledge portal and we mentioned the client library now there are other features related to knowledge uh, we will save them for future videos we will we will touch on them when we discuss videos for example we have something called Uru coach uh, and we have basically these videos are embedded throughout the platform as well